Okay. Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 52 first round match and what a first round match this is. Two unbelievable teams, Sad Lad in this incredible Lizardman team with a Natty on the bench and the sure hands to get him to him and an unbelievable Orc team as well that's very TV efficient with Vara Gulchua and in the booth is the man, the myth, the legend, Skuro Mezzo. Hello. Hello everyone, back for more Blood Bowl after very much yesterday claiming it was probably my last game in Blood Bowl 2, if not ever. Uh, here I am again because I was bored this morning and we uh, already have some uh, Lizard's armor breaking. But before we get to that, we have to give the, uh, the Famir shout out to the country of the day in today's country is Eswatini, formerly known as Swaziland. That's right, a small country in South Southern Africa. I think if uh, Satterfield's in here, he can probably give us more information about that country than I ever could. But their national flower is weirdly the Edelweiss, uh, and their national dish is something they're probably gonna settle up with uh, to watch this game. It's the Karoo Roast Ostrich Steak. Ooh, that sounds pretty good, actually. I could go for some roast ostrich. How about you, Jim? Oh yeah, sure. There was an actor, wasn't there, from Swaziland? Uh, probably. Richard, e. Richard, Richard E. Grant. I did not know that. But I didn't know they changed the name. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's Eswatini now. I don't know why that name changed. I don't know if it was like somebody, you know, like imperialists that backed off of it or something. I have no idea. I don't know much about Swaziland at all. No, I, I, just, I just know Richard E. Grant from there. Or Eswatini, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Eswatini is what it's now called. Patrick I do know that it's come up. It, it, it comes up a lot on GeoGuessr for some reason. Mm. Um, so I, I'm pretty good at identifying it now. <laughs> or I was three years ago the last time I played GeoGuessr regularly. <laughs> Wild. Oh, man, look at this. This is just a mess. Everyone's in contact. Everyone's punching everyone. Oh, yeah. This looks like... A, oh, this is just guard on every player on both sides. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yep, loads of guard, loads of mighty blow. Like, literally just loads on both sides. It's wild. Loads of strength. Oh, there's a removal. <laughs> oh, God. 13 lives. There you go. God, that'd be hell, wouldn't it? <laughs> Not my bag. Not my bag, personally. But I know, I know, I know some people in uh, polyamorous relationships that are a hell of a lot happier than uh, single married couples. That's for damn sure. <laughs> Stand firm. Stand firm as well. Oof. Yep, loads of stand firm. The, these Black Oaks are incredible. Look, there's three Black Oaks, all with Black Guard, Mighty Blow, stand firm. Unbelievable. Do not, do not see a lot of Varag, uh, ever, really. I don't know that I've ever actually seen him in a CCL game before. No, no. The, well, the problem is, Ripper's about the same cost, and yeah. strength 6, so it's like... You'll, you'll see more of him in Blood Bowl 3, because he's strength 5 in Blood Bowl 3, so strength 5 in Block compared to strength six and no block is a, is a tougher choice, right? Like, s some people will take uh, Grashnak over um, who's the, whoever the other one is, like Lord Borak, whereas I don't really ever see a reason to take uh, Varag over Ripper, yeah. personally. Getting I'm just waiting for uh, Dimmy G to show up and mention the fact that that one time I built a very complicated model on stream, he <laughs> seemed to think it was the most challenging thing I ever did. I don't even remember it being that big a deal. It was just the instructions on it sucked. <laughs> I will never I think forget. I, did cut, I, think I, I think I did cut myself on a hobby knife after talking about how my fingers are so callous that I never cut myself on <laughs> hobby knives anymore. So that I probably deserved. I do remember the three days that you streamed building that Varag. <laughs> it was one day of building the Varag and three days of painting orcs. <laughs> oh, I built a troll at the exact same time, so it's like it wasn't even just that model. But that model sucks to build. If mm. anyone has built that model from the box that they know. It's not, it's not, uh, it's very unique in how like GW plastics go together. Mm. Is he Ooh, going this is the... something here. Yeah, I thought he might be going for the 3D, but he's just basing. 
Instead, that's weird, isn't it? Like, it, very what strange, weird. What a strange thing to do. Instead of like, you literally make it a three D and then don't three D, and just leave somebody in control yeah. of the ball. It's a bit weird. I mean, he could just get one dude here by skinks if he wants to. Yeah, maybe that's what he. Maybe that's what he wants. Maybe it's like a trap, a trap hit. Um, but you know, you're losing out in the fight here, which seems bad. Oh wow, the the sk the the source is coming in. For a one D doesn't knock off the damage. Oh wow, Cass is far Oh off. my goodness. Oh, oh. <laughs> Varag, no. Well Oh now there's guard, so Oh but they yeah. yeah, he's used the blitz, but it's a, but it's two, three, still four, so it's a one D, yeah. Yeah, it's still one D. Wow. Honestly, but that's better still to uh, indeed him. Ah, but then he's got to stand firm. Because yeah. like keep still him though, there. getting Varag off the pitch and the ball double base there by uh, do I? No, neither of them have uh, sidestep, do they? No. Yeah. So no, the side not the side steps are coming. <laughs> oh. It's yeah. It's not game over for the orcs here, but it's certainly not looking great. <laughs> no, no. I mean, what what do you do? I guess you've got to dodge away now and then. Yeah. Blitz one and try and run up the field somehow. Could he blit? No, he can't even. Yeah, he can't chain out. Mm. Not easily. Just needs to cast up like three swords, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That's a good strategy. <laughs> this is the first game, Dr. Delicatessen, first game of the stream. Absolute he banger of a match. He sure does have his uh, priorities set on upfield away from the ball, that's for damn sure. Yeah, this is... Just going to make the skinks beat him, I guess. Hope he breaks armor, which he doesn't. Here's another hit on a skink. Uh, gets him with tackle. <laughs> Severe narcolepsy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah, I'm watching on delay because your stream sucks, <laughs> so... Fair enough. Oh, dear. <laughs> God. <laughs> This is this is problematic for the Orcs. <laughs> in in my experience, when you tell the the quote unquote weaker player on the team to have to beat you, they will beat you every single fucking time. So <laughs> I mean, especially when it's the, this like, easy. Yeah. Like this is like I do hard. get the mentality a bit. I do that sometimes where I'm like, well, you know what? If you could roll the dice, you deserve the win. But mm. there's not very hard dice to roll here. <laughs> no. No, very easy dice, in fact. Yep, and there it is. And then mm. there's a free skink on the side there. Yep. And score. And score with a three plus. Yep. And a removal. Maybe you want to stall oh it, but maybe you just get this. Maybe you just get the touchdown. Uh, honest, honestly, there's. I think I'd stall a turn. There's basically no threat on the ball. Yeah, but you can you can go two nil up yeah. as well. <laughs> <You know? laughs> That's also true. That's also true. He's got what two removals now. Yeah, and, and the Orcs are out of re-rolls, and mm. he hasn't exactly oh, inspired confidence with how he's played the first time. Yeah, fair. What's the uh, what's the bench for the Orcs? Just one player? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so. yeah. Yep, so now they're down. Oh my god, Vara. Yeah, you've cast his star player as well. He's, he got a babe in Vara, so... And taken nothing, so yeah, it's a pretty amazing... Pretty amazing first drive for the lizards, isn't it? And you've got the one turner in your back pocket, so yeah, I think that like the back the one turner as well makes this instant score better as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Anyway? Well, I'm wondering how many uh, Lil and Gennies are changing hands on bets in favor of the uh, the lizard men in this one. Of course, the Lil and Genny is the official <laughs> currency of Swaziland, <laughs> uh, although they are known to use the South African rand as well. <laughs> Just in case, uh, in case we in case we were wondering. Mm, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew that one off the off the cuff. I definitely wasn't reading it off a website poorly. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> yes, I feel most of the money we've been on the lizard. I mean, the lizard team is is unreal. Like they can struggle a bit versus the orcs at higher TV, right? Because the orcs will have like tackle mighties, and they they do have tackle oh, mighties. They've no. got two tackle mighties to hunt the askings. Oh, he's not based at least. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is this is could have been a tragedy. I mean, it's a hell of a it's a hell of a lizard man team, isn't it? 
Yeah. And you sure don't want your movement four player with the uh, the four turn attempt here, but uh, you don't want to hand off either. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's the thing. This is like lizards can always get banged out by anyone, right? Like it's and, and obviously these orcs are very very strong, so like they've got more chance than most. They've got a lot of mighty blow, so it, it was closer at the start. But I mean, I still think. Lizards were favourite at the start, and now it's they have become a lot more of a favourite, haven't they? Pro does nothing. Well, uh, if you if you were curious, uh, truly notorious, if if someone in uh, Swaziland did want to pre-order Blood Bowl three, it would set them back five hundred and twenty-eight point thirty-seven Swazi Lilingenies. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> as opposed to the twenty nine ninety nine USD uh, retail on Steam. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Guru. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course. Well, fantastic Just, uh, yeah. The Lil and Gally right now, yeah, it's looking at a, uh, what is it, a uh, one Lil and Gally to uh, about about five, uh, just, uh, about six cents, uh, <laughs> six cents USD. <laughs> God. Maybe if they uh, stocked up on some uh, some British pounds, though, they'll get a better rate because that thing's basically worthless now, isn't it? Yep. Correct. Oh, dear. And, and now straight away, look, this king's so on the ball. Oh, God. Oh, God. Is this going to be like 3 0 or something? Yeah. Yeah, this is. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> At least both of the games you've dragged me in to commentate, and by drag, I mean I just openly volunteered and showed up to do, uh, have been uh, short, sweet, and to the point. <laughs> haven't, really, haven't really drawn it out whatsoever. <laughs> no. no, they haven't They haven't read the script, have they? They haven't, they haven't learned from the NFL and made an exciting script for these games. They've just, uh, <laughs> just been demolition jobs. I, I'm not stealing his content. I'm uh, supporting it because I respect his content. I, I keep it up. I keep up the tradition when he's not around. Yeah. Yeah, that isn't stealing. Stealing. Uh, <laughs> healthy and consistent, Steve. Thanks for asking. <laughs> getting good fiber right now, so we're good. Nice. Stealing is me making this new emote totally copied <laughs> off of a uh, mm, sandwich. So there you go. Yeah, I'll post there. Look, a, a new glory symbol. <laughs> Cannot tell what's going on in that emote. <laughs> yeah, no, it's too small. It's, it's like, and it's also, it's, it's too hard to explain. It's from like the. Is it? A, is it? A, is it a rat feeding a pizza to me? <laughs> yes, yes, it is. But then it's also just got cum written at the top of. <laughs> Oh, I definitely can't see the cum, Jesus. <laughs> exactly, yeah, that's a, it's that's not so bad then is the Not the first not the first time I've said that in my life. <laughs> hey! It's a it's a gif on, on Discord for some reason. It's just uh. hilarious. It's the most it's the most niche. Discord thing Discord ever. gifs are out of control. They're just completely uncensored. They're <laughs> unmoderated. Yeah. Oh man, there's another one. Yeah. Ripperoni. Yeah, this looks uh, pretty fucked for the orcs, doesn't it? So Who does? Gone. No, interesting. I, th I thought he'd have gone for the uh, pickup with one of the two, you know? Like, come round, pick it up, and then run away. Like, he was here, wasn't he? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I would have gone like to the left. I guess he's just really trying to defend, but... You don't really need to defend when you've got a natty and a show hands to get it to him, do you? <laughs> well, well, there you go. Yeah, unbelievable skink. About the perfect skink, isn't it, really? Oh! Oh! <laughs> well, just kill the skinks. Uh, he's obviously... Veloso is red is reddit. He's killing the skinks. 
Now Sadlad will have to field the, t the two good skinks. <laughs> hmm. This Black Orc's hardly in his square, is it? Oh, that's How weird is that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that is bizarre. That, that's uh, that's some classic tabletop bullshittery right there. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Where you're like, oh no, he's in the other square. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking big guys used to people used to do that all the time with him. Yep. Ooh, only pushes, and he's pushing him forward. I guess one, two, three, four, five. Six. Yeah, yeah. I guess that's right because he's gonna have to get it past him. So yeah. <laughs> There's a chance. There's a chance. You're telling me there's a chance, no re-rolls, but there is pro. Okay, there's not pro. He's just what? What? Punching a skink. I mean, it's fair enough. Kaz's skink is uh, is better yeah. than the Lord's chance to score, yeah, probably. Just, just kill the skinks. He's basically winning. Yeah. So, yeah, I guess he's gonna set up a one D to try and push the uh, Karax off the ball. No, he's gonna make. He's not even trying to score. Oh, that's a bit sad, isn't it? Uphill the Crocs out of the way. Well, the circle's still in the normal place, it's just the... the, the yeah. <laughs> That's yeah, he really does weird. does pull him out of the way. Yep. There's a chance. Alright, so I guess he's gonna wing it to him, like, well, but like, what? Oh, I guess he would've had to dodge through that square anyway. Yeah, fair enough. Wait, what? He just goes into a tackle zone for no reason? To make it a what? six instead of a five? <laughs> okay. <laughs> well... <laughs> what? Alright. <laughs> what do we know about that? Oh no, Sat uh, no, the, the Veloso. Veloso's mm. playing the Arcs. Does he have a history in uh, CCL? I am unfamiliar with the coach. Oh, oh it is very, very sunny, so I guess it didn't matter, huh? Ah, uh, right. Still don't particularly know why you'd go there, but. Yeah, I guess why not? It's like. It's like people, people do that when they've got. Uh, when they've got. Nerves of steel, isn't it? Just because it doesn't make any any difference, really. They just go, haha, look, I can yeah. use nerves of steel. But I guess he thought, ah, oh, it's suddenly anyway, so I'll just do it with no reason not to. In fact, it might even be better for more chance of a more chance of a fumble, so that it wouldn't go out and then get counter yeah. scored. But then there was no counter score. I know, yeah, there was no counter score on. Uh, but yeah, huh, fair enough. There you go. Well, if he can get a bit of luck on defense, uh, at least the uh, the important skinks are going to be exposed now because all the other skinks are dead. Yes, yeah, like three three cast skinks is a pretty good half. Yeah. Um, going one nil down in your offense and losing yeah. your star player isn't so good, and your apple. Yeah. <laughs> if he had just protected the ball better, even if he didn't score, if it was zero zero and those skinks are out, you're feeling okay about the orcs. Not great, but okay. Yeah. Yeah, whereas now, this yeah. skink might just score, and then he's going yeah. up, and then he fucked. And that's that, yep. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, it, you should, this is one of the funny ones where you really shouldn't try to one turn. You should just play normally, yeah. because you're a monster lizard man team. Yeah. But, I mean, that's exactly what we saw happen in the game yesterday, right? Like, they... Well, they technically, they did once one turn when they probably could have just eaten, oh, who is it? It was Tree, right? Yeah. Tree ended up one turning and could have just wasted an extra turn, and that extra turn cost them the game. Mm -hmm. Yep, for sure. Um, but that in that situation, like, going for the quick score was totally fine, right? Whereas in this, you don't really want to go for the oof, quick score because uh, you don't need to because you've got the better team, haven't you? Whereas yeah. I think... Tree was right to go for the quick score, and then the, if you're going for a quick score, then you might as well do it on your natty. But then, yeah, as it happened with a touchback and that, would have probably not gone for the one turn. Yeah. Um, we dacking here. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, it's a pretty low risk daca, but like you've got so much advantage, team to team, right now. <laughs> In, in terms of, like, sending the fight. Maybe they're not truly dacking. 
No, just it's probably more just, back. Yeah, 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 the half decker, the half. <laughs> The lizard man half classic. Like it's a classic half yeah. decker for lizards, isn't it? Because your your seven fight their team, and <laughs> yeah, and it's <laughs> pretty much a fair fight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it really is. <laughs> nope. There you go. Even fairer now. <laughs> <laughs> Apple, this. Oh no, his his apple's gone. Uh, if he had the apple, I think apple there would be pretty good. But didn't have the apple, so never mind. Obviously, sad lad's apple is just is just reserved for the natty at this point. I think. <laughs> I like maybe a dead saurus, I guess. Like a three skill or a four skill saurus. Death, I guess you are for that. He's not giving up, is he? Don't say it's over. Putting both tacklers forward. That's uh, a bit risky, isn't it, without having one back? I would like one back as a safety and then one pushed up. But at least he's going for it anyway, you know, like kept getting both uh Getting both forward, like at least at least he's trying, you know, trying to be active. Whereas I remember that match yesterday, where there was no real effort to uh, to get forward and hit him in the face. Yeah, but it'll be like perms only, right, Ducky? It won't. It won't be like a. Wouldn't be like an apple on a badly hurt at this point. Is, uh, is what I was thinking. You eat any badly hurts now on Saurus, no matter how important the Saurus are for this match, you're eating the badly hurts. That's what I was thinking. I just didn't articulate it very well, or at all. Yeah, I wasn't listening anyway, I just figured I could say make sense and we could move on. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> oh, is there some kind of chain here? Look at this. It's Not really. <laughs> oh, is it just... No, it doesn't do a... Yeah, so he's... No, he's not doing anything. No, no, it. no. no. It's like, it's gonna it's getting, getting some 2Ds. Getting him some 2Ds while he loses the game on the right side of the pitch. Oh, no, no, it gets him, it gets him in range. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He's got room, room to run, baby. He's got Taco, and he's hitting the nutty, and he's broken his arm, and he's KO'd him. Oh. He didn't want it scattering out? I guess yeah. not. Yeah. Oh, so the chin push was good. There you go. Oh, that's that's not great for him, though. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that was good. Yep, yep. Mm. We were definitely paying enough attention to this game at that moment. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, it was still pretty shit. Like even without the chain out, it was would have still been a dodgeable GFI, which is still two laps yeah. from from Sadlad, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I guess he was like, um, I guess the thing the thing was, yeah, he could have appled that. He could have appled that KO. Um, I think you appled the Natty more than you appled the Saurus. Oh. Yeah, that was a bit lax by. Sad lad, really. And now, he stand it, but, well, yeah, now, now this is looking really good for the orcs here. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of lizard men players out all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> classic, classic dub skulls there. Instant dub skulls. <laughs> you better move that. Okay, good. I thought he was gonna throw a block before moving that line up. <laughs> Look at this. He's chaining everybody now. Oh. And the 3D blitz with my blow tackle, flip me. Yep. And the other and the other skink is surrounded by tackle as well. Mm. Yeah, all of a sudden. Very nice recovery here. <laughs> all of a <laughs> sudden. Yes. This game. Oh my god! This game is on the brink after a couple of turns. What the hell? And he's caught it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> What is happening? Oh, 
Oh, that was an apple. Oh, is this a KO that you apple? Wow. This is crazy, isn't it? <laughs> Crocs won in nines. Do you score to try and win in normal time? No, you've got to uh, you've got to stall it out and go for overtime, should we? Try and uh, beat these people up a bit more. Beat them off. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention again, but I heard something about beating someone off. <laughs> I thought that'd get your attention. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, do you just score and like try and win in normal time? And then I was like, no, that's stupid, of course not. You just play for the overtime now, right? Yeah, yeah. Just try to, and try to beat them off in the meantime. <laughs> yeah, because now the, the lizard men are all in disarray here, so you can kind of cherry pick them, maybe get another removal or two. Mm. Pretty nice. The crabs I gave my flatmates were the best crabs. That's well, turned into something. Okay. Yeah. I gotta let a dog out. <laughs> Hello, sandwich. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Ducky. Yeah. So, like, so if if it was the orc drive then scoring early, there's a lot of value in scoring early because then there's only one chance to get the natty back. But, like, rather than two. So, yeah, let, let's pause it for a second. So, if this was the Orc Drive, I'd feel there is, there is value in scoring in scoring now um, so that then they only get one chance, to, well, not now, like, but the last turn. They're doing value in scoring last turn so, so they only get one chance to get the natty back. And then you've got four turns to turn them over and win in normal time. But that's if it was the Orcs Drive. Because if you didn't do that, they'd get two chances to get the Natty back for overtime. Whereas now, I think, seeing as you're going to score on like, the actual turn 16, and they're only getting one chance back anyway, it's definitely better to, uh, to stall it out. There you go. Didn't know until sometime in the second half. Yep, this is the first round of Chalice. Two absolutely monster teams. These two teams could be in the final. Like, that's how good these two teams are. Absolutely unbelievable. Uh, horrible draw for both of them. Oh, and a dirty player foul as well. Lovely. Yep. And a cast. Another oh skink God. out. Oh, baby. This guy is really red, red, hasn't he, Veloso here? He's, he's literally mm. hit. He's hit skinks like five times. And he's cast three and KO'd two because one was apoed. And then, he, and then he's are fouled we, one and cast it. Are we down to one skink? Oh, no, the one turner is KO'd, right? Yeah. Mm. I mean, overtime without skinks is GG. Yeah, he's got to foul the other one as well. Yeah, so it's just the one. Now, now imagine that though: the one turn it comes back from KO, you win the toss, and you just one turn with it and win anyway. <laughs> it's After hard. All fucking that. <laughs> it's hard. But how do you get him the ball? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, you'd have to have a Saurus pick it up and hand it off. To him. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> It's a glory, it's, it's a glorious rat. I don't know how it... So, yeah, Soul just randomly discovered it on Discord. Comrade <laughs> was my nickname on my football team. <laughs> God! <laughs> it, 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 it wasn't. <laughs> oh my God, another cat! What the hell? This is, this is insane! I don't think I've ever seen skinks go out with this alacrity. No, it's unbelievable, isn't it? Wow. Wow. Holy moly. I don't believe it. My, my nickname, however, in, on my baseball team in high school was Jar of Flies, though, which with a bunch of Bostonians was Jar of Flies. <laughs> but, uh, 
because I one day wore a T-shirt of Alice in Chains that was their album Jar of Flies, and my coach <laughs> thought that was the greatest thing in the world, so they just called me Jar of Flies. <laughs> oh my God, I'm not the- <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I'm not playing Blood Bowl. Oh my Jesus good lord. Like fucking... <laughs> Still though, it's all the sweeter if he just wins it with the one turner anyway. Gets like a gets a fucking uh gets gets a uh, touchback, puts it on the one turner and just wins <laughs> yeah. it. Yep. Another foul. Another <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> He's gonna Remember fall. when we gave up on this orc team on like turn four? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the this is the poster boy for "Don't say it's over." <laughs> yeah, yeah. Jesus. And also, you say you say you're glad you're not playing Blood Bowl, but if you were the orcs right now, you would be fucking fully erect. <laughs> god. Yeah, yeah, Ducky, exactly. That's the thing, isn't it? That's what I thought. Like, why even bother, like, make, building up an amazing team when you can just get diced in the first round? And yep, Sad Lad has, uh, has certainly had the comedy mega in the first round. That's unbelievable. Does he even get wild. the natty back? That's the question. No. <laughs> <laughs> Neither. <laughs> Neither comes back. <laughs> and the orc comes back. The orcs don't win the toss, though. The lizard men have got the ball. All four of them. All four Saurus have got the ball. <laughs> oh my god. I can't wait to see how the lizard men win this game. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. This, what a turnaround. This has got to be one of the biggest turnarounds in Charlie's history, isn't it? Yeah. Flip me. Apparently, Verag, uh, who's the difference maker in this one, huh? Yeah, yeah. He's, he's... As soon as they got him off the pitch, the orcs were like, "All right, it's game time, baby." <laughs> yeah. They reacted how you would be, you would if Tom Brady had got injured. <laughs> uh, so in 07, when he when he hurt his knee, I I wasn't watching the game. I was driving, so I only heard the uh, the announcements. I spent two hours in the car telling myself that they were being. Uh, hyperbolic without having even seen the injury and that he'd be fine and then he was out for the season I was like ah he'll be fine he'll be fine I was in denial straight up denial <laughs> oh, yeah sandwich wow well he's trying look he's, he's going for it sad lad he's, <laughs> he's going for the Saurus pickup handoff potato <laughs> did the right thing, you know, like, he was going for it. He was definitely going to go for the pickup and the potato, well, and it, it might have been okay as well, because he'd have gone six double G of five. Well, the thing, that's the thing, four. is, like, the only thing there that could get to him were two linemen. Three yeah. linemen. Yeah. I don't I don't think the strength four could have gotten to him if he had made his GFIs. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Like, yeah. it's a little ridiculous that, that that strength four tackler, not that the tackle matters, really, uh is not a safety like yes. he didn't have a single safety back yeah he absolutely should have had a safety like yeah. you've got four like, there's yeah. four players and they're all agility one like dude just have a safety uh, you've got yeah. the perfect thing it's strength four just leave him yeah. back like yeah you're gonna win regardless but like fuck you for not having a safety <laughs> back <laughs> oh man Oh, sad lads here. This was fun. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, probably was for Veloso. <laughs> and fun for us. <laughs> but yeah, this is this is bollocks, isn't it? I mean, this is why I didn't like about... It's, it's what I didn't like about Rebel. You know, like, Rebel was even worse because Rebel was like, I built the team for years, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I built, I built, literally built the team for years. And uh, and then it was just killed, and, and that was it. And it's like, well, what a what a waste of time. And and then this is this is the same kind of thing, isn't it? You know, you spend seven weeks, and then you make up a great team, probably the best lizard man team that's ever been in in CCL finals. And then you wait, just get diced to fuck. Wait, sad lad, are you saying Veloso is Yakis day? No. 
Is that is that true or is that or did I misread there? Oh, that's amazing. That's fantastic. That's just <laughs> Just no fucking notes on that one. Chef, <laughs> chef's kiss. Sorry, French kiss. Call it a day. <laughs> just, just everything about this now makes makes it perfect. <laughs> the perfect game of Blood Bowl here. <laughs> Statistically bad at stats. Not necessarily statistically bad at stats. Finally, a gym farm. Yeah, I think I think you probably got a bit careless, sad lad, because I think that shouldn't have been as easy as it was. Because even if he hadn't done the chain, it was still a three-two-two, wasn't it? For a yeah. TV with tackle. On. On the best skin to have ever set foot on a blood ball pitch. <laughs> Gotta be up there. I mean, you could argue that instead of sprint sure feet, you could just have, you know, strength four. But it's pretty good having sprint sure feet and being like a, a fantastic natty, isn't it? Oh, the Blitzer's edge for two, so it would have been four, two, two. Ah, okay. Yeah, then obviously, yeah, it was, then it's yeah. just. Absolute dicing it after that. After that, it was a comedy mega. I would I would have recommended to improve your game, Satellite. You don't fail so many armor rolls on on skinks. Uh, <laughs> in my experience, most most lizard players learn that pretty early, and uh, their skinks don't just die off when everyone is shrieking that they need to uh, kill the skinks off. And yours did, so yeah. it, it must mean you're bad. Yeah, that, that was a real bad decision to have his seven hits on Skinks result in six yeah. cast Skinks. Yeah. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> but that, I mean, that's lizards. That's lizards, and that's what happens to lizards sometimes, isn't it? You know, like, that literally is what happens to them. Like, they are unbelievably strong, but they're also very brittle, and, and they can't handle losing Saurus very well. And, you know... People will get to hit skinks occasionally, and they're not that durable. And sometimes you get unlucky, and, and you lose a bunch. And yes, they are always going to be a bit dicey at lizards, uh, but you know that was still a co absolute comedy mega dicing. Like that was, that was completely ridiculous dice. Seven cars from sixteen AV breaks is unbelievable. Yeah, that's um, absurd. Yeah. Well, I'll close this one out so I can talk about the SFL in the daily. Glorious. Well, uh, there you go. Commiserations, sad lads. Con con congratulations, Veloso. Thank you very much, Skuro. Being glorious having you in the booth again. Always. Always a pleasure. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.